And checking in on IHSA baseball scores, McComb gets by Farmington 14 to 7. Payson Seymour losing against Calhoun 11 to 9. West Central Griggsville uh, Perry were going at it, and West Central gets a 21 run win. Bushel Prairie City 14 0 over Astoria. Brown County losing to Quincy today. Raiders were celebrating senior night as they get that 11 run win. Rushville Industry losing against Unity 8 to 3 the final there. West Central and uh, yeah, Illini West were going at it, and it's uh, Illini West winning 13 to 7. Meanwhile, in baseball action also across the river, Louisiana Bulldogs getting by Marion County 13 to 1. Also, Hannibal, big win over Bowling Green, 11 to zip. HHS now 13 and 13 on the season. Knox County, meanwhile, losing against Centralia, 17 to 7. Monroe City falling against Clark County, 23 to 1. Indians now 16 and 6 on the season. North Shelby, 22 to 2 winners over Community. Palmyra, meanwhile, losing against Liberty, 5 to 4. Scotland County, Tigers versus Tigers tonight. They get by Ken, 8 to 7. Marion County and Liberty were going at it, 13 to 1. Liberty gets the dub there. South Shelby, 7 1 winners over Mark Twain. Cardinals now 16 and 3 on the season. Now the 11 and 1 Blue Devils will travel to 10th and Jackson tomorrow for their crosstown showdown battle against Quincy Notre Dame on the diamond. Quincy High was hard at work on the practice diamond, working on their defensive fundamentals as they prepare for that highly anticipated matchup against the Blue and Gold on Tuesday. QHS head coach Rick Lawson had his squad trying their best to take this rivalry matchup on as just another game. That's to try and make sure the Blue and White. Don't get too high or low as they face the Red Hot Raiders in less than 24 hours. It's obviously a big game, crosstown rival, but we've been playing some really good baseball recently, and uh, we're, we know we're perfectly capable of competing and beating them. We just got to come out strong and uh, play our best game and uh, look to get another win tomorrow. Sound like they're very confident going into the game. It's going to be interesting. Be sure to tune in also to WGM Sports Center on Tuesday morning on the Radio Airways, Liberty High Head Bass. Fishing coach Paul Fessler will join Ryan Muma at 7 a.m. They'll bring you all up to date on the exploits of the Eagles bash fishing team. So be sure to tune in and join them on the radio airwaves. That's a wrap for sports. We'll be back after this.